Hello children, welcome back to math class. Now we are in lesson 4 of block 1. And the aim of lesson 4 is to identify odd and even numbers. The keywords used are even numbers, odd numbers. Now children, tell me the things which we can buy as pairs from shop. Tell me the things which we can buy as pairs from shop. Yes, very good. We can buy many things. Here I will show you few things which we can buy as pairs. First, in this picture, you can see a pair of shoes. Next comes pair of socks. Next come a pair of earrings. pair of gloves. So the things which we can buy as pairs are a pair of shoes, a pair of socks, a pair of earrings, a pair of gloves. Now it is very clear that what is a pair? A pair means it should have two in number. Again, a pair means it should have two in numbers. Now, in this picture, you can see apple, right? Now, my question is, do the apples make a pair? Do the apples make a pair? Yes, very good. The apples make a pair because here we have two apples here we have two in numbers so we can see that we can say that it make a pair now in the next picture do these apples make a pair yes children very good in this picture the apples is making a pair here we can see two apples. Here also we can see two apples. So together, all together we have four apples. And all these four apples make a pair. So the numbers which make pairs are called even numbers. Again, the numbers which make pairs are called even numbers. See here. The numbers which make pairs are called even numbers. The first point is even numbers make pairs. Again, even numbers make pairs. Next, next point, even numbers end with 0, 2, 4, 6 or 8. Again, even numbers and with 0, 2, 4, 6 or 8. The two points you should keep in mind is even numbers make pairs. Even numbers and with 0, 2, 4, 6 or 8. Examples are the number 20. The number 20 ends with 0. Here see the number 20 ends with 0. So we can say that 20 is an even number. Next 32. 32 ends with the number 2. So we can say that 32 is an even number. Next 34. 34 ends with the number 4. And 4 is an even number. So we can see that we can say that 34 is an even number. Next is 36. 36 ends with the number 6 and 6 is an even number. So we can say that 36 is an even number. Next comes 78 and 78 ends with the number 8. So we can say that 78 is an even number. 
so you should keep in mind that even numbers make pairs and even numbers end with 0 2 4 6 or 8 after this now look at this picture here in this picture you can see an orange right sorry okay here you can see picture of orange do the orange make a pair no here the orange is not making a pair does not it does not make a pair here now look at this picture do the oranges make a pair here no here one is left here one is left one is extra so we can say so we can say that it does not make a pairs in this picture the oranges the oranges are not making a pair now next picture here do all the oranges make a pair here it is pair in this also here it is pair but when we comes to here it is not pair one is extra one is left without pairing so we can say that in this picture the oranges are not paired the oranges are not making pairs so the numbers which do not make pairs are called odd numbers again the numbers which do not make pairs are called odd numbers the points here are see for see the first point odd numbers do not make pairs again odd numbers do not make pairs odd numbers end with 1 3 5 7 or 9 odd numbers end with 1 3 5 7 or 9 examples are 11 see 11 11 ends with the number 1 and 1 is an odd number so we can say that 11 is an odd number next comes the number 13 13 ends with the number 3 3 is an odd number so we can say that 13 is an odd number next 35 35 ends with 5 5 is an odd number so we can say that 35 is an odd number next is 47 47 ends with the number 7 and 7 and 7 is an odd number so we can say that 47 is an odd number and next is 59 59 ends with the number 9 and 9 is an odd number so we can say that 59 is an odd number so it is very so now it is very clear what is even and odd numbers right and what are the properties of even and odd numbers now open your content book page number 4 see in this picture you can see numbers from 1 to 50 colored with blue and orange shades the numbers in the orange box ends with the number first uh, see see the first column so in the first box all the numbers ends with 2 so means all these numbers are even numbers next in this box all the numbers ends with the number 4 so all these numbers are even numbers next comes here all the numbers ends with 6 means all these numbers are even numbers again here is here it is ending with 8 again all these numbers are even numbers here all the numbers end with 0 so we can say that all these numbers are even numbers now we'll move to the green box in green box the num first it is ending with the number 1 and number 1 is odd number so we can say that the number in the green box is odd numbers next comes this box here all the number is ending with 3 so we can say that 
here all the numbers are odd numbers here also the same here the numbers uh, numbers are ending with 5 so all the numbers here are odd numbers here the number is ending with numbers are ending numbers are ending with 7 so all the numbers here are odd numbers here the numbers are ending with 9 so all the numbers here are odd numbers so here in this picture the number in the orange box ends with even numbers so all the numbers in the orange box are even numbers and in the and the numbers no, green box ends with odd numbers so the, all the numbers in the green box is odd numbers now examples shade the boxes with odd numbers now what is the rule of uh, finding uh, finding odd number yes the number should end with 1, 3, 5, 7 or 9. First we will take the number 10. Here 10 ends with 0. And 0 is an even number. So we cannot shade the number 10. After 10 comes the number 1. We already learned that 1 is an odd number. So we can shade the number 1. After 1 comes 22. Here, by mistake, it is colored uh, yellow. Now here, uh, 22. 22 ends with the number 2. And we know that 2 is an even number. So, we cannot color the number 22. After 22 comes the number 5. So, here, we already learned that 5 is an odd number. So, we can color the number 5. After 5 comes number 71. And 71 ends with the number 1 and 1 is an odd number so we can color the number 71 and 47 47 ends with 7 and 7 is an odd number so we can color the number 47 after 47 comes 80 here 87 87 ends with the number 7 7 is an odd number so we can color the number 87 comes 55 55 is an odd in 55 5 is an odd number so we can color 55 after 55 comes 93. 93 ends with the number 3 and 3 is an odd number. So we can say that 93 is an odd number. After 93, finally it comes 98. And 98 ends with the number 8. And we know that 8 is an even number. So we cannot color the number 98. And finally, the answer looks like this. So the odd numbers here are 71, 87, 93, 1, 5, 47 and 55. Now question, next question. Write two even numbers and two odd numbers, two digit. Using the digits 1, 2 and 5, the digits may be repeated in the number. So here the given numbers are 1, 2 and 5. And using these three numbers, we have to write two even numbers and two odd numbers so in this given number first we will write the even numbers okay in the given numbers which all number are even in this given number the only even number is two so for writing the even number the rule is the number should end with two so here first number we can write here is 2. The number should end with 2 and the next place we can write any of the numbers. We can write 1 or 5. Here I am writing 1. So the first even number here is 12. Also we can re repeat the numbers. So the next even number is 22. Next we have to write odd numbers. Here the odd numbers are, the given odd numbers are 1 and 5. So, the, uh, for uh, writing the odd number, we should keep in mind that the number should end with 1 or 5. So, here I am writing 21. You can write your own numbers. The uh, thing you should keep in mind that the number should end with 1 or 5. And in the next place, you can write any of the given numbers. So, here the number I wrote is 21 and 50. 21 ends with the number 1, 
and 1 is an odd number so 21 is an odd number and 15 15 ends with the number 5 and 5 is an odd number so 15 is an odd number now open your workbook page number 5 is 4 thank you